We are rolling! Hello, welcome everybody to the channel. If it's your first time or if you are a returning subscriber, thank you. This channel is called the Future Space Collective where we review products for imagination. So today on the channel, something I've been waiting for for a little while, uh, a few videos back, I did an AliExpress haul where I purchased a ton of decor all around the theme of anti-gravity. Anti-gravity, basically things that float. I've just been fascinated lately by this idea of floating decor through magnets. I, I, I just, I love magnets. They're freaking awesome. So let's jump right in. I'm super curious. This thing came overseas. I don't know how this is even possible, but it showed up five days. Five days after I bought it, it showed up on my doorstep. So I think that's pretty awesome, considering, you know, how far it did come. Coming right from Hong Kong. Oh, I'm not even gonna look. You guys can look before me. Okay. It has arrived. Magnetic levitation display for your coveted sneakers, all you sneakerheads out there. Uh, first impressions. The box looks pretty good. It's pretty heavy, if I had to say. It probably weighs four pounds, this box. And it's packaged up real nice. 360 degree rotating sneaker display. Here we come. Bye bye shrink wrap. Ooh, it even, it has magnets on the box. Again, what are you guys seeing? Some documentation slides right out, beautiful. It comes with a scale. From what I understand how this works is the weight of the shoe needs to be at a certain, within a certain like threshold. So if, if your shoe is too light, then you can weigh it down. Um, they provide you with weights. Here's the weights here in this, in this snazzy little bag. You know, I gotta say it's packaged pretty nice. Okay, all right. Let's take the, the weights out. What is this? Power brick right here. That's the, wow, it's like really in there. Here we go. Boom. Quite possibly the best part of unboxing any product, really, is taking off the shrink wrap and getting a, a nice sexy shine to it. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, so shiny. Oh yeah, it's like perfect. It's like perfect, it looks great. Boom, and is there one on the back? There is. So you, you'll see how it looks kind of dirty. Dirty no more. Oh, let's see what the uh, documentation has to say. Comes with a shoe tree, the electronic scale. Mm, these look like, these are like marbles. Very cool. I think that's probably to weight it down. Two AAA batteries, included or not included? Are we gonna need the scale? No, scale doesn't have batteries, of course. Oh look, even this has shrimp, shrink rack. Ah, shrimp wrap, shrimp wrap. It has a shrimp wrap. It comes with shrimp wrap. Shrink wrap on the scale. Oh, it's actually quite quite a nice little scale. I don't know what this thing is for. But here's the powerful magnet. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay, let's just maybe leave that there for a second. <laughs> Please set the product on a level table, otherwise it won't levitate normally. Let's let's check it out. I have a level. That's that's a good. Let's 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 go. Let's explore, shall we? All right. We have our level. Wow, that's a powerful magnet. Just get a little organized here. Are we are we level? It could be a, a bit better level, to be honest, but... Okay, but let's uh, plug in and the LED will light up. Before... All right, let's plug it in. Let's, let's see what we got going on here. Power into the unit. It lights up. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So the light here is contained uh, within the middle. I'm not even gonna bother with their scale. I'm just gonna go with my scale. So I guess, I guess we need to get a shoe. So we've gotten our shoe. So I think they want us to put the shoe tree in the shoe. So this shoe is sitting at 497 grams. 
But if we take the shoe tree out, and we're sitting closer to 450, honestly, with the shoe tree in, hold the shoe in your right hand and the auxiliary block. All right, here's the auxiliary block. Oh, something is like booting up. You guys seen this happen live? All right, all right. So to take it out, oh my goodness. It's a freaking rotating, levitating sneaker, guys. Are we level? We're definitely not level, so that could be screwing it up quite a bit. Very, very interesting. This is so weird. It's like, what is this invisible force that is holding my shoe up and making it rotate? There's my rotating, rotating. So it's kind of like, I think because it's not totally level, it's not rotating evenly, but you still get the point. My, my, is that neat though. Okay, what do we do next? We obviously try out some different shoes, I guess. I don't know. Let's see what else we got. So let's weigh this shoe. I never thought I'd be weighing shoes. That's a new thing for me. This one's close to 500 grams. Wow, every time it gets me. Because of this little strap though, it looks like it's... Let's just move that strap out of the way. It's so weird. Oh, this shoe's like too big for it. What are we, we coming in? Okay, perfect. So this shoe's coming in a bit lighter at 423 grams. So let's add a marble. Let's see if we can get it exactly 450. Okay, that one marble does the trick. All right, let's try this shoe because it is weighted more appropriately uh, to what the spec is supposed to be. So let's just see how this guy works out for us. You see, it is lighter. It is, it is hovering a bit closer to the top. We got to get it on some level ground. I mean, that's about as level. So first impressions, well, hey, it works, guys. It works. It made it to me in one piece quickly. It's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome. I'm pretty impressed. I do like it. So I've had some time to use the display, I've let it run for a few days, and here are my final thoughts and review of the product. So who is this for and what would you use it for? So this product is absolutely great if you're a sneaker head, a sneaker collector, if you're enthusiastic or passionate about shoes or sneakers, this really is a must have piece. It's also great for retail stores, you know, I could really see it flying if there were 10 of these in a display window, something like that. I think it would really catch people's eyes and bring them into the store. Or if you're trying to sell your own sneakers or your own shoe product, I think it's a great way to create content for marketing, for advertising. You know, it's great as a video background. It's great as decor in the home if you're into this kind of thing because it just has such a pleasing look and aesthetic. The more I've let it run and looked at it over the last couple of days, the more I kind of fall in love with it. It's, it's just a really unique look and it's a really cool way to show off your shoe or your sneaker collection, your grails. It's very futuristic looking. It's got a real sci-fi feel to it. And I all around just love the look and aesthetic of it. It photographs quite nicely. So where to buy it? I've provided a link in the description below, directly from AliExpress. This is the absolute cheapest price I've found this particular product from. And like I said, it only took five days to get to me directly from the supplier in China. They shipped it with expedited shipping. No problems there. You can also get it on Amazon. I was browsing Amazon a bit looking for this, but I was finding it was a lot more expensive on Amazon. But I've also provided the link down below if you're more comfortable ordering from Amazon. Anyhow, that just about wraps it up for today. If you enjoy the content, please, I ask you to engage with the video, comment, like the video. Everything helps to grow the channel. If you'd like to help grow the channel, if you believe in this idea where we explore the world of products for imagination, that is how to bring your space into the future and create a sense of atmosphere through lighting and decor to build out mood that inspires a feeling of creativity and imagination within. That's what we're all about here at the Future Space Collective. So I ask you to hit that subscribe button, join the collective, and we'll see you in the next video.